welcome to the series on stock analysis using google sheet in this video we are going to compare selected stocks based on their pe and roe values we are going to create a scatter plot and we'll compare stocks based on their pe versus roe values when we represent data in form of a visualization chart we can easily derive meaning from that so we learn what are the outlier stocks based on these scatter plots so let's get started you can see here we have retrieved return on equity and pe values from screeners website how to retrieve this data we have already learned in our earlier video you can find link for that video in the description here i have selected few stocks which i am going to analyze so first let's prepare scatter plot so let's see what are the steps to create scatter plots so we select this data which includes roe and pe values we go to insert select a chart now on the right hand side we'll see options for configuring it so let's see those options so the data range is d3 to e15 which contains roe and pe values on the x axis roe is by default selected we have a series called pe now if you see this data we do not find any label for example we hover on this which stock it represents we do not get any idea let's provide labels to all these stocks so to provide labels we need to add information in our data range so you can see that labels are available in b column so let's add that column in the data range so we put comma and then we write b3 to last row so we use here open reference now once you do that for the series now i can add label i click on this three dots select add labels and from here i can select label so i click here and i select this script as a label so you'll see here we are able to see labels for each stock now how to interpret the data generally return on equity is higher it is a good indicator but price to earning ratio if it is very high it may represent that stock may not be a good one so you can see here we have few stocks which have higher roe values but have very low pe values same way we have few stocks which have very high pe value but very low roe values so based on this pe and roe comparison we can find out which are the outliers so you can see here adani green is a outlier and here adani power is also outlier now let's compare stocks of only adani group to get better idea so in the data we can see that stocks for adani group are till row number 8 let's configure to have shares of only adani group I click on this edit the chart in the data range i select last row as e8 hit enter now you can see we have stocks of only adani group if you see here adani green has very high pe even for adani enterprise also this pe value 317 is very high whereas adani transmission also has pe value of 196 and if you see their roe which is not as good as that of adani power which has roe value of 56.1 if you say adani ports which has pe value of 29.3 and roe is 14.7 so from this visualization we can say that these are outliers so maybe in future the prices of this stock may may fall because they are at very high pe values whereas adani power which has high roe value 
but its PE value is very less. So maybe in future this stocks may go up. So this visualization can provide better insight into data. If you look only at the numbers, we do not get any any insight. But if you use data visualization, we can easily find out outliers. We can easily find out which stocks may be performing better in future, which stocks may perform worst in future. Thanks for watching and happy learning.